beauty. It's Spartan Stog Night. Oh yeah, look where you hit that tree. Lord, thank you for the opportunity and for blessing me with the shot and the blood trail. I pray that you'd help me to find that hog in Jesus' name. Amen. Got him. That stalking the night worked out. We walked right up on him. It was actually two of them and uh, got like 14, man, 12 or 14 yards. I mean, it was tight and it was good. And uh, just waited till he fed around under that hog light when it was full bright. Uh, didn't need to use the red light, the piglet light. I just used the uh, sportsman hog light on the feeder. And uh, sure enough, he fed around there, fed around there. They were kind of push each other back and forth under that feeder so I waited till they kind of to one side and I snuck around to the left the opposite side they were at and when they fed back this one got there first 
I was already drawing and in the edge right past the bushes and it just fed out under that light and that green uh, feeder light kind of blinds them so I'm standing there 12 14 15 yards full drawn right there I just walked out broadside shot him went about 40 yards he made a bunch of racket through all this brush and grass it took a little while to find him because uh, it's so thick uh, but yeah man it was awesome about a hundred pounder 110 pounder perfect eating size little boar and uh, he came in here last night and smelled where I walked he, he smelled my footprints when I walked up to the stand there was two of them like here and behind me and the moon was real bright and uh, I could definitely tell there was one but it sounded like another one and when he smelled my footprint he kind of jumped walked back and then just eased back off eased off without any you know ruckus or he didn't run off and make a bunch of noise. He just slipped out of there. And that's pretty amazing of how, how smart these pigs are. Um, and they, they smell you or know you're there. You don't even know they're there half the time when they smell you and bust you. And they slip out of there and you sit there the whole time. And I've sat there plenty of times. Nothing, nothing, nothing. But they're there. <laughs> you just got busted and they left. You didn't even know it. So, uh, you know, Botech is getting old. But it sure shoots good. Y'all be safe. Thanks for watching. God's good and He'll make a difference in your life. You just put God first and everything will fall into place. Praise be to God. See you soon. 130. Not too shabby. So we're the Christian Bow Hunters of Texas, the Christian Bow Hunters of America chapter in Texas. Look us up on the web at huntforchrist.com. God's good.